Hi everyone and welcome to day 752 of Wild Writing in the Time of Corona, where I have done um, a something of a random poem in response to some prompts that I created equally randomly. So um, uh, the idea is just, it's like a bit like a jigsaw puzzle with words. Um, you put them together and see what you find, see what the result is. So um, my prompt today were a country and I chose India. Uh, the second one was a work of art and I chose a poetry collection I'm looking forward to reading by a Vietnamese poet called Ocean Vuong. The gesture was hands on a head. The um, next one was a photograph and I chose a photograph I'd taken of children dancing in the sea or children playing in the sea. Um, and the fifth one was a way to sit and I chose the adverb comfortably. And this was the result that um, I got, which I'm liking more as I read it more often. So here we go. All the world can come to us almost accidentally. For as time is a mother, her children in the sparkling sea joyfully are born. We are never more with this world of ours than in this moment when comfortably we sit on ancient stones, on chairs, on kindly knees, on sand, on buses into new lands in the mist. Or we stretch our bodies into other horizons from our small steel seats in the sky. Settled in sapphire seas, we first glance India in sunrise. Descend into the day, for time is a mother. She has your hand. And that's the uh, the poem. I think I particularly like um, Ocean Vong's title of Time is a Mother, but I think it, I quite like the way that time has our hand. And of course, time does have our hand and leads us through. So um, that's all for today. I hope you are continuing to take very good care of yourself. Um, and you uh, enjoy the poems and um, I shall see you again in a few days for another one, maybe even an Easter based one, as that, what, as that is what we're celebrating in the UK this weekend. So until then, you take care. Bye bye for now.